we're gonna play we we're we gonna play a game. We gonna, it's, it's called top five. All right. Okay. So I'm gonna ask you a question. I'm gonna ask you a question. Yeah. And I want yeah. you to give me just pretty much the top five of this question. All right. Okay. So okay. I want you to give me the top five. The, the top five things that an independent artist in South Africa needs to to at least get noticed to blow yeah. to, to get to blow up like what are the top five things they need to blow up in South Africa? Um, uh, first off, in in South Africa, it's not it, it's kind of hard to be independent, but it's also a good thing. Um, so, so for you as an independent artist, if you wanna make it or you wanna you you, you wanna pop, I uh, should put it that way. So it's either you should have uh, number one, if you're not like uh, uh, like uh, financial stable from home, you need to have a job. Mm. You know mm. what I'm saying? So that the job is gonna pay for your studio time. Mm. Um, pay for your shooting, pay for your music videos, uh, pay for your tours and all other stuff, you know, that comes with the music as a business itself. Gotcha. So you need to have debt, you gotta have debt. Number two, um, you you gotta have, if you're not working, you gotta have a family that is fully behind you, that supports you, that's mm. actually, that's there for you as, as the family, as they they they, you, they have to be your number one fan they have to be your number one uh to them you have to be like the person that they want to see him or her there mm. so that's number two so number three um you gotta you gotta come differently than the others because I mean, we are in a country where there's it's a lot of artists, and then, but the, the country is not that big. You mm. understand? So you, sh- you should have like something that's going to be outstanding. So some niggas here, they, what they do is they come, they coming out as, as clowns and mm. c- catch their attention. And once you got that attention, and then you then, then they then in- reintroduce themselves as rappers as a singer as as something else so Mm. you need to have something like a gimmick or something like that you know so that you can be i mean get noticed and then number four you need to trend so i don't know how other people do that but if you want to blow up here you need to trend and number four number five number five you just need to be i mean you just need to put in 110 percent in whatever that you do you just need to keep on doing it again and again and again and don't stop you know what i'm saying because some people they tend to stop just because of they don't see it but it's also depend on what you here for are you here for the art or you are here for the fame the money the cars and all the other stuff so if you're gonna if you're gonna if you if you are here for those stuffs clearly you're going to try all by all means to get there which i personally know that there's going to be shortcuts and you know when it's shortcuts that means your thing is not solid anything might happen and then you won't have any 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 fallbacks but if you have been putting in work and having those relationships and constant like doing what you're doing when you finally break through and when things don't work you actually have the fan base that it's like for you not the fan base that just like we just know you now because you blew up you mm-hmm. understand or you cheated or you cheated your way up you understand mm-hmm. so mm-hmm. so that what you need is to actually be patient and keep on doing it keep on knocking those doors if that's one that doesn't open try another one you know you just also to be a person that have ideas of saying um if this doesn't work let me try this if this doesn't work let me try this and you know n- even if you leave that that whatever that you were trying but don't actually just drop it like that just say let me try this one but i'll go back there because you may never know gotcha so money yeah don't, don't quit your day don't don't quit the day job if y'all, if y'all yeah that's, that's what i'm getting like if you ain't if you ain't got a rich family you don't come from wealth don't quit exactly. your day job. Don't you quit need, your day job. You need you need you need support. You know, you need a lot of yeah, support. You need support. Uh yeah, you, you need, need a lot of support. 
You know, some of y'all, yeah. I mean, I said, if you really want to blow up, you might want to, some of y'all clowning, tap dancing out yeah. here. <laughs> you know, doing things, you know, that's against what you believe in, but you want to do it for the money and the fame. But yeah, you know, I guess just like here in the United States, I guess you got an option. You either going to be, yeah. you, you got to go with the, um, you either going to just go for the goal and like just shoot for, shoot for the stars, but you might have to yeah. go with what you believe in, or you might want to do it for the love of it. And eventually the money will come. So you got, I guess, you, you, come, you, yeah. you got to, you had a crossroads sometimes at one point, you got to make a decision. And that, that's what it sounds yeah, like. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. That's true. That's true. I mean, you reach a certain point where, where you like, you know what? I've been doing this thing here for so long. Um, mm -hmm. Let me just make an example. Right now, what uh, South African hip hop has been debating about it was that mm -hmm. South African hip hop is dead. Um, mm -hmm. The reason why they say it's dead is because we got this new genre that's is taking over um, our industry by storm. It's called a piano. So mm -hmm. that genre it just popped up, I think, about two years back, and it just took over. And right mm. now it's hitting, it's hitting, um, I mean, like the international standard. So mm. now, so now what's happening is they try to say um, the hip hop cats should also mix hip hop and I'm a piano. So in, in together, so, so that you can, so like right now, if you want to pop, you must just mm. rap on I'm a piano beat. So what that does that sound like? Yeah, that's interesting. So, so, so um, it's a, it's look. Go, please go ahead, go ahead. So I'm sorry. Yeah, go, go. Um, so it's a, it's, 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 it's a, it's a, you know, like a deep house, but uh, like, it's a deep house that's slow. Okay, the tempo is so slow. slow. Yeah, it's a house music that's that's slow. That's oh. the tempo is too low. Yeah, it's slow the tempo, and then yeah, so it's too much of of of, of the piano that that has been played. So okay. that's why they calling it ama. Yeah, that's why they calling it ama piano because of that. So right. now that's yeah. So now that that the type of gender just came in and then it it's took trap. over. Sound like trap music. Yeah, yeah it's, it's, it sounds like trap music. Trap music. Yeah. Okay. Trap yeah, music. exactly. Yeah. Okay. It sounds okay. like when when we when 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 it happened when they were trying to uh to to fuse um uh, R and B and hip hop. Mm. You remember the time where you, we we had we had to have like a right. singer and then yeah. mix with rap and all of this. So it's something that's just like that. Because at that time, I believe. R and B was 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 shooting up, so yeah. hip hop needed to blend in with it. So it's yeah. the same thing that's happening here. So like like um, I had a conversation with the, another lady that wanted to actually uh, take over and and be my manager and stuff, and she was like, oh, wow. um, "But we're gonna need yeah, we're gonna need one piano song from you that you mm -hmm. gonna rap over there." I'm like. I'm like, ah. <laughs> you, ask, I'm like, you, you know me. Do you have one? Do you have one, yeah. that, you have one that, you, that we can listen to, man? Yeah, yeah, I do have. I do have. I do have. Yeah, it's yeah, right yeah. in my computer. So what I will do is, um, I will email it to you. Yeah, send I'll that email to it to you. Yeah, then, man. yeah, I will send it to you all. Then you can listen. You can listen. To what when you talk about on my piano, this is what we talk about. So yeah, now, man. the the trick is, if you wanna blow up quickly. Yeah, if you're an independent artist, so you need to actually jump wow. into that beat mm -hmm. uh, and rap over it, and then cause wow. something that's uh, that's happening right now. It is wow. it is gonna you know it's gonna get more attention. Gotcha. So that's what most of the mo that's what most of the kids right now are trying to do. But um, I mean, I I said I will see. Because I was I wasn't feeling like you know jumping into another gender just because I wanna I wanna you know I wanna I wanna I wanna I wanna blow up. Yeah. So because <laughs> it it will be like I'm cheating the game because once mm. I blow up with another gender, then when I'm when I'm actually introducing myself to mm. say hey actually right. I'm a hip hop guy, it might right. work, it might not work. 
it might just like be like hey man you just need to stay on this piano rap on this piano and then right. you actually forget about the the, the actual mm-hmm. genre that got you here right right that, that that's that's important being staying true to who you are because you know when you when you're starting a a um starting to get a fan base you know yeah. it's like it's like okay um well you like you don't sound the same you know what i'm saying now yeah now your fan exactly. base is kind of mixed up they don't know what you do um well, exactly yep so 